Hi, I'm Nolan Bushnell. Um, I founded Atari and Chuck E. Cheese. My current project is a, is a project called Brain Rush. And Brain Rush is a software company that creates educational lessons based on five principles of brain learning. And it turns out that uh, you can almost look at today's school and almost everything they do is wrong. <laughs> and uh, while that sounds, that's a big statement, brain science really looks at education in a very different way. What, how, is the brain, how does the brain learn? And it turns out that the brain is actually designed to forget. Um, if you remembered everything that you saw and heard, all of a sudden your brain would fill up. So what's the difference between something that you just want to observe and then discard and something that you want to remember? Well, some people say, well, you, you have to decide to want to remember it, but it's not quite as simple as that. What you really want is to follow these five principles. The first principle is extreme time pressure. If you have extreme time pressure in a piece of software, like a video game, um, it turns out that you are in the education moment. You're not thinking about what you're doing after school or the cute boy that's sitting in front of you. You're thinking about the project. Number two, active. It turns out that if you're actively considering something by having to answer a question about it, that is a learning moment because you can't answer without fully and deeply considering the situation. Third, play to mastery. That means that you can't complete one of our lessons until you know it all 100%, almost into muscle memory. And what that does, it says a gentleman C you have to be on your game because you know you can't complete the lesson until you know it 100%. Like it flips a bit in your brain to make it more, more effective. The fifth principle is spaced repetition. It turns out in order to remember something for the rest of your life, you need to repeat it, but over a period of time. That's why cramming for a lesson before a test is not very effective. Um, you need to review something after 24 hours, after two weeks, after a month. And it turns out that these review cycles can actually be exponentially longer. And so if you have the right review cycle, you could remember everything you learned in high school and college for the rest of your life. The fifth principle is adaptive. And that comes back to everything that you do so that the software needs to know what you know, what you don't know, review the things that you don't know, and change the timing a little bit. Because it turns out there are a lot of people who just have a slower clock. That doesn't mean they're not cognitively brilliant. It means that their brains just run a little bit different speed. And a lot of kids today are growing up thinking they're stupid when in fact they're just running a little bit slower. And so you want to be able to normalize the time uh, equivalently. And if you do that, you can increase the speed of learning anything by a factor of at least 10 and retention of over 80%.